Hey, Microwaveables, welcome back to LEGO DC Super Villains Customs. Now today, I thought about doing another Office Custom, but we did an Office Custom recently, so I didn't want to do that. So I looked back on my older videos, and one video stuck out to me, and that was Shell from Portal 2, and now we're going to be bringing her over into our army of LEGO DC Super Villains Customs. So yeah, let's just head right in and make Shell from Portal 2 and 1. I think, yeah, she was in one, but uh, in my opinion, Portal 2 uh, has the most content I can pull from, and the outfit in Portal 2 is much more recognizable. Okay, I think I'm going to switch out Sonic. He's a bit too loud, so we'll replace him with Link. Much more quieter. Um, I think we're on this side, yep. And we'll be getting rid rid of Bender from Futurama. Uh, appearance, head, head, head. Uh, this is pretty simple head. Um, I think uh, I feel like this would probably be the mat best match. So uh, let's match it up. Yep. Okay. Um, it's black hair. So. Boom, and then lip color, uh, about there, yeah, and no accessories are needed, alright, head is done, no neck pieces are needed, no back pieces are needed, uh, hair, it's in a ponytail, so that should be pretty easy, uh, it's, it's not quite like that. Oh, uh, let's see. Mm, yeah, no. Oh, no. That's more of a uh, Padme. Should, should we make Padme? I feel like we should make Princess Leia first. Though. Oh, boom, right here. That's perfect. Alright, black is all the way up here. Boom. Already looking great. Arms. Um, well, her right arm has a little bit of something. Uh, he is, she has, like, this cuff, this, like, band-aid or whatever cuff on her right arm. So, get that into effect, because we want to make, we want to make the best representation, oop, representation of the, of the character, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Alright, and then left arm is just blank. So, it's blank, and boom. Looking good. Uh, yep, we're done in here. Uh, no helmets. Hands, uh, this color. Um, I think we can do one of these custom bodies, and I feel like the best match will be probably be this one I think yeah let's change it to colors actually so yeah um up there she is will match up that skin tone I like there I guess and then yeah white yeah all right uh, and then body decals, it's, it says aperture sign, so we gotta find something that somewhat matches. It's like a circle, so, dead shot, I guess? I feel like dead shot will probably be our best choice, but let's just check down here. Alright, yep, we'll do dead shot. Uh, wait, could we change the color of that? I wonder if you can fill it in. Ooh. Uh. White is better. Yeah. That's much. I don't know what I was thinking about changing the colors. That was kind of weird. Um. She has. She has like a little gray part of. On her, uh. Hips. So. It's like. That color. I don't know why. It's just there. Uh, 
legs. Uh, we want like something that's like like a boot, but it's like a little bit over. Oh, uh, and white. So yeah. Hopefully we can find something like that. Ooh, how does this? Let me guess. Is it going to change the white? Oh, you can't even change it. Okay. Guess we're not doing that then. What does this change? Dang it. Um. Ooh. This might work. Orange. Ooh, that looks cool. That is shell. Uh, no capes. Uh, no hand gloves. Hit impact we'll do style one and we'll do the main portal that most people think of as the blue one I would assume most people think of and then jump slam normal actually let's get let's get a, a bit of a portal feel uh, I feel like that one because it's more 2d like a portal so an orange there we go all right Personality, health, health icon. Uh, we'll do yet again uh, teal for that portal color. Uh, standard health since you can die in the game. Wait, it's not up here. All right. She doesn't talk, so that's kind of tough. Um, I guess standard voice four would probably be the best choice. Uh, speed normal target um, uh, death storm because it's sort of flamey for the orange portal sort of looks like flames uh, normal pose and of course we gotta go into weapons for her classic portal gun Man, if only I had a portal gun. I mean, it would be terrifying for other people, but for me, I'd have a pretty good time. Uh, it's either this one or this one. I feel like... Mm, mm, I feel like this one is looks a lot smoother. And that little top part can be like the little arms at the top. I don't know. Well, n not at the top. At the front, it has like these little black little arms. So. I don't know why they're there. Hmm. Um. No grow. Um. Double jump. Uh. No harper jump. Because. The. The. Boost jumpers or whatever that are built into the ground in the game that's not going to be part of it we're not going to i don't think we will include anything from the environment of the game maybe we will i don't know um so we can get both bolts in we'll do for tap square instead of attacking we'll do weapon hopefully this works uh, bolt style. Uh, probably style one. Bolt color. We'll do blue first. There we go. Uh, target. Mm, nah, let's turn off targeting. Uh, ooh, what should it be? Sonar, I guess. Uh, hold. We'll do drone access. Uh, to represent the little turrets, even though she doesn't control them, but you know, just trying to fill in these spots. Uh, and then of course we'll do another bolt. Again, coming from the gun. Uh, style one again, but this time it's gonna be orange to get that represent should we turn 
we'll come back if we can't think of anything. All right, and then selling our bolts. Hold will do. Hmm. Hmm. Ooh, I know. Beam. Uh. Yeah, the stop. No, not that one. Oh my god. Style three. Um, and we'll do. All right, which gel do we want to do? The one that makes you bounce, make you faster, or the one you can place portals on? Uh, uh, let's do bounce. Uh, ooh, more combat updated. Cool, I guess. Um, beam color, it would be. Uh, what what color is it? I think what I remember it's orange. I might I might be wrong. I probably am wrong. But yeah, what I'm thinking is like maybe it makes like the glass or whatever shakes like bounce around so much and it's like little area that's stuck into that shatters. I know it's kind of dumb, but you know it's the best I could think of. Uh, skills, uh, no grapple, uh, technology, yeah, it said technology based game. Uh, there's not really a lot of acrobatics. Uh, but most female characters in Lego games do have acrobatics, so, you know. Um, no super strength. Uh, no graffiti, no illumination. Hazard protection, sure. She walks through the, all those gels. Who knows what chemicals are in there? Um. But yeah, shell. Boom. Affiliation, aperture science. Uh, but who would be the best representation of that? Gotham City Police Department. Why not? Uh, hero. Yeah. Defeating the bad guys. Yeah. GLaDOS, Wheatley. Alright, let's head outside and uh, check out her abilities. And, you know, this custom came out really well. In my opinion. Tell me what you think. And also, tell me if that was the right color for the gel. Yeah. Alright. What the? What the? Ah, uh, come on, that was like the main thing. Ah, uh, okay. Head up, head back inside. The shooting is not working, even though it's showing it shooting, uh, shooting in the demo of what what was supposed to be doing. Sorry, we have to go back, but you know, like that's a, that's a key part. That's all right. We'll switch it to right hand. Instead of weapon. Man. You would have think since it was not like a pistol or anything it would still shoot, but and it did show it shooting, so I was kinda confused. Yeah, right hand. And it's best that we do it while she's running and all that. So it's less obvious. Um that isn't coming from her weapon. Alright, there we go. That should work. Two video game characters in a row, I just realized, because last time we made Sonic, and now we're making Shell. Well, we made Shell, I should say. Alright, hopefully this will work this time. Yes, okay, it's, it's not perfect, but you know, this is what we did for a while. Uh, can we still hit, like, punch people? Yep. Sort of. Um. 
Okay. Then we got a little drone to represent the turrets. Cool, cool. Um, and we got orange portals, of course. And we got, um, our gel. Uh, jump, double jump, jump, slam, dodge, and dodge. Ignore the gunshot. Uh, so yeah, guys, this has been another episode of LEGO DC Super Villains Customs. Today we have made Shell from Portal 2 and 1, I guess. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.